Hey guys, I'm Akash from Pabli Connect team and in this video, I'll show you how to test Facebook lead ads using lead ads testing tool. So a lot of users were facing issue while setting up their automation with Facebook lead ads and they were unable to test the Facebook lead ads testing tool. So in this video, I'll show you how you can easily use the Facebook lead ads testing tool to set up automation between Facebook lead ads and Pabli Connect. So let's begin. So this is the Facebook page where I am running my Facebook lead ads campaign and I want to set up an automation for every lead I am generating on this Facebook lead ads campaign and get it inside Pabli Connect so that I can create my workflow and the automation using Pabli Connect. So after logging to your Facebook account to access the lead ad testing tool, we just have to go to your browser and search for developers.facebook.com. So it is developers.facebook.com. After reaching this page, click on My Apps and after reaching on this My Apps section, click on Tools. After clicking on Tools, here we can see all the Facebook developers tools and here under Other Developer Tools, we will scroll down and we can see there are lots and lots of tools over here. And out of all these tools, we will click on Lead Ads RTU Debug Tool. Just click on it. And here we reach the Facebook lead ad testing tool. Yes, this it is this easy to access the Facebook lead ads testing tool. And here at this page, we can see few options over here. So the first option is page. And in the drop down below, we can see that all the Facebook pages which we have created in our Facebook account can be seen over here. So out of all these pages, on what page uh, we are running our ad campaign, we have to select that specific page. So the name of my Facebook page was Pabli Tech on which I'm running Facebook lead ad campaign and I want to test the Facebook leads using this page. So we have to select our Facebook page over here. So this is the page. After selecting the page, it is asking us form. And in the drop down below, we can see all the forms which we have created on this Facebook page. All the lead ad forms can be seen over here. So we I have created two forms. First one is named as untitled form and second one is Pabli. So I want to test the leads using this form as Pabli. So I'll just click here. And after clicking here, it is asking us an option. It is giving us an option of preview form. So when we click on preview form, the form which we have create, created, the lead ad form which we have created will open in preview mode. But before that, we will read the help text over here, which says you can create one lead per form. You will need to delete an existing lead in order to create a new one. So it is saying us that it is telling us that we can only create one test lead at a time. And before creating the second or another test lead using this very same page and very same form, we have to first delete the existing lead which we have created. So by clicking on delete lead button, we can create the lead. So let's generate a lead first. But before that, let's set up a workflow a test workflow in Pabli Connect. So I'll go to my browser and enter P A B B L Y Pabli.com slash connect. After reaching on the landing page of Pabli Connect, we can see that by clicking on sign up free, you can create your free Pabli Connect account in just two minutes. Or if you already have an account, click on sign in. So I already have an account, so I'll click on sign in. After that, in all apps section, click on Pabli Connect access now. And here we reach to the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Click on create workflow and give your automation workflow a name. For example, I'll name this workflow as Facebook lead ads. testing tool. So we, it is just a test workflow to we are creating in this video. So I'll name it as Facebook lead ads testing tool. Click on create. And after clicking on create a workflow is open over here. Now here in this workflow, you must be familiar that we have two windows triggers and actions. So triggers basically says when this happens and action says do this. So we have to select in trigger window, we have to select Facebook lead ads. So we will select Facebook lead ads. After that in trigger event, we will select new lead instant. We want because we want to instantly get the lead as it generates and click on connect. And here it is asking us to connect our Facebook lead ads account with Pabli Connect. So select add new connection and click on connect with Facebook lead ads. Now guys, as I told you, we have already already logged into a Facebook lead ads account in our browser. Pabli Connect detected that very same account and made the connection. 
and after that it is asking us to select the page that from what page we want to get the new leads so in the drop down below we can see all the facebook pages which we have created and the page for which we were testing leads was named as pavli tech so i'll select this page named as pavli tech pavli tech it is and after that it is asking us for the lead generation form so we have selected the lead generation form named as pavli so we will select from the drop down the form named as pavli after selecting the lead generation form the page access token is automatically detected we don't have to make any changes over here just click on save and send test request and here pavli connect is waiting for webhook response of a new lead from this facebook lead uh, facebook page and this lead at form so now we will go back to our lead at testing tool and here we will click on preview form so we can see that a form is now open up in the preview mode in front of us this is the test lead form and we will enter the details of a test lead over here for example these are the details name is nitin sharma this is the email and this is the phone number of the user so this is a test user guys this is not the actual lead we are just creating this lead or using this lead at testing tool to set up this automation just click on next and click on submit so now we can see that by the name of nitin sharma we have just now generated a new test lead and because we have connected our facebook lead ads account with pavli connect the response of this very same new lead which we have generate will be captured inside pavli connect so we can see just now we have received a response over here instantly we have received the response and in this response when we will scroll down we will find that this is the name of the very same person nitin sharma same email address and same phone number which we have just now entered in our lead ad lead ad testing form in the preview mode so now we can see that using this facebook lead ad testing tool we have generated a test lead and successfully captured that new test lead inside pavli connect now we have to actually learn how to delete this lead so as we saw over here it says you can create one lead per form you will need to delete an existing lead in order to create a new one so we have created a lead and successfully captured that test lead but what if we have want to create another new test lead for that we have to first delete the previous lead which we have generated so by clicking on this delete lead button it will automatically delete the previous lead which we have just now generated just click on this delete lead button and it says your lead has been deleted so the lead by the name of nitin sharma which we have just now generated is now deleted now after that just refresh this page once and once again select our facebook page which was named as pavli tech for which we were testing facebook leads and select the form and after that once again we will click on this preview form button and now after deleting the previous lead it shows us our facebook lead at form in preview mode and here we can generate a new test lead so let's test it again we'll get back to pavli connect click here on recapture webhook response and here we will enter the details of a new test lead for example i'll enter the name of a user like akash name is kumar let me enter the email address this is the email address and this is the phone number and click on next click on submit so now once again we have generated a new lead over here on our facebook lead ad testing tool and as and when we generate a new lead automatically we send, we can see that the details of the response of this very same lead is captured inside pavli connect as well so this is the name very same name akash kumar this is this is the very same email address and same phone number which we have just now entered in lead ad testing tool so guys in this video we saw that how we can use facebook lead ads testing tool to generate test lead and set up our automation and the testing tool captures only one lead at a time one test lead at a time so after generating the first lead and before generating our second lead we have to delete the previous lead by, which we have created by clicking on this delete lead button and after that we can generate another lead once again so guys that's it for today's video where we have learned how to use facebook lead ad testing tool and capture the test lead response in pavli connect so here guys we have successfully used facebook lead ad testing tool to generate a test lead and capture that test lead inside pavli connect now you can create a workflow according to your choice and automation according to your choice inside pavli connect so not just facebook lead ad guys you can connect plenty of other applications using pavli connect and automate your business 
If you need any kind of help or have any queries, you can ask them on forum.pavli.com and you can check Pavli Connects pricing at this link. So if this video was helpful to you, you can like this video. Don't forget to share it with others and to keep getting such content on automation and integration, you can subscribe to Pavli. Thank you. Have a nice day.